Hello, hello, hello! Welcome, welcome, welcome to... Whatever the fuck this is. <laughs> I am, of course, Head Bird Brain. Um, I am, of course, your raven. Good call, motherfuckers. Uh, how are we doing? Also, welcome in, Tori. I'm glad you like the green. I figured, you know what? It's coming up to Easter. May as well make some use of this. I was just trying to get ready for St. Patrick's Day, but, uh, well, that happened. <laughs> um, how are you doing today, Tori? Oh, cold. Oh, so cold. So, so, so cold. All right, well, since it looks like it's just you at the moment, uh, I think we had better just get started, don't you? Alright, so it's been a couple of days. Um, or, well, yeah, a couple of days. So I actually forget exactly where I am. Uh, so let's just hop straight into it and then see what the fuck's going on. Alright, let me see where I am in relation to... Well, anything, actually. Uh, right, okay, so we've done, hmm, okay, hmm, mm, mm, mm. well, I tell you what, we haven't worked with D-Team in a little bit, so you know what, Let, let's start with D-Team today, and why do my colours look all washed out, hang on two seconds, uh, why do they look washed out? Uh, game mode off? No, put game mode on. Uh, it still looks a little washed out, but it'll do. Okay, uh, very, very sharp, stabby headache, and getting ready to have the office by myself. How's the head? Head's doing okay, thank you very much for asking. Um, you know, gratefully appreciated. Um, better than it was yesterday, at the very least. Right, okay, so. What do I fancy doing with D-Team today? Um... Um, hmm. how's the phone treating you? Phone is treating me pretty damn well, to be completely honest with you. Uh, yeah, which one do I want? I'm gonna go with this one. But no, I've got the phone almost in a position where I've finished setting it up. Uh, transporter, oh jeez. This might not have been the right one to do yet. Um, where's Vi? I don't see her. She could have woken first and wandered off. Sigma. Sigma. Okay, yeah, this is one of the later huh? ones. Whoops. It's after midnight now. What? Tell me the year turned over. It's no longer the year 2028, but... 2029. How long have we been asleep then? My long enough. Was ten and a half hours ago. You're talking about the vote at 1330? Yes. Oh, don't worry. You've that been awake mean since we've then. Only been sleeping, though. We could have woken up several times. And have You're done. saying the amnesia drug made us forget. Well, better start looking for Fi. There's the sound, yes, by the way. You're right. Hello, Gab. So, Fi has gone walkies. Sounds okay. Fair enough, fair enough. It's a little quiet for me, but I, I can deal with it. 
Um... Okay, yeah, I'm just having a look with about a second this delay here. Rooms. That fi, where'd she go? Oh God, no, no! I... To the transporter room. Oh, zero. I can only assume you are searching for something. If you'd like to learn the whereabouts, do as I say. Damn it! So, what are your orders? First. I shall explain the room to you. As the name suggests, this room contains a device called a transporter. It was discovered roughly 140 years ago, in the year 1888, at the South Pole. A German expedition okay. was exploring the area. At one point, they became lost, and subsequently stumbled upon it. The device was carefully transported to their homeland and researched in secret. Okay. What they eventually uncovered was the fact that the device was not made by man. Okay, Perhaps it your came point. From a distant planet or some alternate world. Regardless, they determined the intelligence that created it far surpassed that. Okay, why do you have it? Despite not understanding how it worked, they figured out what it was used for. This device is capable of transporting things through space-time. Hence why it was named the Transporter. Okay. But its construction is much different from what you'd normally expect. If you look toward the back left corner, you'll see something resembling <laughs> this is the nucleus of the transporter and controls its function. Okay. And to your right, you should be able to see two objects that look like beds. These are called input pods. Look further right. Okay. The two objects similar to Crusades are the export pods. In the back is a large container called the material tank. Inside is oxygen, carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, a variety of chemical elements that exist on Earth stored individually. Okay, yeah. You use it as follows. First, place the material to be transferred into the input pod. Mm -hmm. We'll call it X to simplify that. Next, select the location of transfer on the pod console. Pulling the lever will cause the input pod to begin scanning. Okay. This scan reads the exact placement of each atom that makes up object X. The obtained data travels through space-time directly to the transfer point's nucleus. That nucleus will then analyze it. It will send the necessary elements from the material tank to the export pod and recreate uh -huh. Object X's original form. Precisely. Recreate it? Essentially, it acts as an atomic level 3D printer. Okay. A massive amount of energy is required to do a transfer. Once a transportation has occurred, it takes roughly 10 months to recharge. Ten months, jeez. During that time, a variety of objects can be placed in the same pod. However, in order to transfer a human, each pod must only hold one body within it. Okay. Two or more people cannot go into a single pod. It is very difficult to recreate individual brains and proteins. I obtained this machine back in 2009. It had been stored in a huge facility. Okay, so that would American be about had, 20 years prior to this game, nearly. German loss during World War II. My explanation ends here. There is a special characteristic about this device, however. This transporter is not simply a device that allows you to teleport. Okay. 
Okay. What is transferred is only the atomic data. The object itself does not get transported. Furthermore, that data travels through space-time. It does not just go to the past or present, but also to other histories. Other histories? Oh, no, no. Now, my instructions. Currently, no power runs through the transporter nucleus. It is completely stopped. If you are able to restart it, you may obtain that which you desire. Now, I know you'll do your best. That still doesn't Good tell us where Phi is. Alrighty, so... Like I said, doesn't tell us where Phi is. Alright, what have we got here? A card! A star card! Is it Triangle? Okay, so pentagram, okay. Uh we've got a birdman? Okay. Oh. And what is this bloody machine? Something goes into the vertical and horizontal axes. Okay, so we can't use it yet, so... Okay, fine. I wasn't looking at that, I was looking... Oh, for God's sake. I was looking at this! A human in two moons. Huh? Okay, so the surface is cold. Okay, uh... Okay, yeah, uh, creepy nucleus, yeah. Okay... That's a point. Sigma has been in it for a few pods at this point. Can we pull the lever? Yeah, I guess not. Yeah? What makes us real? I don't know if that question that can be answered. Well... I don't want you to answer it, so... Hmm... Okay... Okay, so we need to continue powering up the nucleus. Oh, apparently that's something. Okay, so the machine's not on yet. There's nothing there. Oh, no. Uh... Alright, what do we got here? Hmm. Actually, I don't know what we've got here. A security camera? Hmm. Security cameras normally don't point downwards. <laughs> You've never seen a security camera. Place cards here. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, so that lit up and it changed the color of the card too. Okay. Maybe we need to turn them all on. Oh no. I noticed something too. Placing the card here changes it to a different color. Okay, yeah, you're right. I think they're the only ones I have right now, so that doesn't help me too much. Um. <laughs> right, okay. Uh. Oh, wow! How the hell did I miss this? Two crescent moons. The sun. The human. And the pentagram with the sun. Or with, yeah, with the star, even with the moon, even. <sighs> right, so now that I know that they're scattered on the floor as well. <laughs> okay, and a single crescent moon. Okay, oh, there's another one. The wind. How many have we got so far? Seven. So that's number ten. Oh, there's two more. Three moons. Okay. And. A flower? Okay, so seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes, yeah, so I've got twelve now. I think. Oh, no, oh, there's another one. Thirteen. Human and moon, okay. He said that. Sure you can. Right, so is that the ball? Looks like it. Okay, let's start scanning. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. <laughs> He's actually putting out things to say. Twelve. Thirteen. Okay. It, whoa. Hologram stereoscopy. That sounds painful. Okay, chapter one. Wind equals zero. Okay, so that's done. So Whoa, okay. So, Birdman, 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 
flower human? Hmm. Okay, this did something as well. Okay, what if I put the... Symbols crash together and they will disappear. Huh? Okay, that time one of them crashed out. Huh? Any of that is meant to me. Uh, oh, hello, there's uh, something new again. Ah, chapter two, okay. The alien civilization that created this transporter utilized 13 symbols, each one representing a number from zero to 12. Their relationships are as follows. Oh, God. Right, okay. So, a human times a moon becomes a human and moon. Human times a human. Human to be human is two humans. A pentagram and a moon is that card. Two moons gives the double moon. And the more I look at it, it looks less like a moon and more uh, and more like a banana. Just saying. Uh, Christ. Okay. Question, okay. Oh, what? Uh huh. Well, we know that goes there because it the the book outright said it. So the only the number that I can't get to with any combinations is seven, because it's a prime number. And this flower looks like it's got seven circles. So I'm going to provisionally put that in seven. Then I need to think. Okay, it does remember me. Okay, good. Right, okay, so let me have a think about this one. So it only goes up to 12. So, two cubed is eight, three cubed is uh, 27, so, okay, so, 
so the moon I think the moon has to be two because it can't be one because one times one is still one and one times one times one is still one and all of them can't be one so I think the single is two, the double is four, and the triple is eight. It's the only thing that makes sense with the numbers that we know we've got. Okay. I'm presuming Penta is going to be five. Uh, but I just don't know. I just do not know. Now the, okay, so the human with two moons has to be Oh, excuse me. Bear with me two seconds. I'm just having a a little think. Uh, hmm. Hmm. So. That, okay, so the human. Okay, the human. So the human on its own. Something times four. can't be one because four is already taken it can't be two because that's already taken human is three i think that would work actually yeah so i think Human is three, and human with two moons is twelve. That being the case, three times three, uh, so that would be nine. And three times two, so that would be six. And what have I got left? I've got 1, 5, 10, and 11. Well, if we go with the idea that this is probably correct, uh, Penta obviously being 5, so 5 and 10. And then I remember from the pathway, uh, from the, the, the star thingamajig, that this was actually quite a strong card. It beat whatever it was. So I think that's one and that's a living. I think that's the solution. I think. Hey, it is. Uh, chapter three and four. Oh, God. Okay, so chapter three just confirms exactly what I already knew. Okay. Chapter 4. In order to operate the nucleus, four cards must be placed on the sensor. The Alien Society has two methods for expressing the numbers, however. 
by converting the numbers or symbols displayed by the nucleus to a second format, you will determine the correct cards to place. What? What? Oh, okay, that turned on this time. Okay. Uh huh. Displaying the object is going to make it. It is a 3D printer. Does that mean it's going to make it? No. Okay. Now, why did that only print 10? Decagon reels, okay. And something else appeared. Decagon reels, okay. Four of them. Hmm. So I think that's probably something to do with here, because this had five and four. Okay, so they're, they fit. Right, so this... Oh, God, what was it? Was it? Hang on. Uh, what was the code? It's been so long trying to work out the other one, I forgot what it is. Birdman, 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 Lotus Human. Get to here. Uh, hmm. So the number is being converted. Yes, yeah, so Decagon 0 to 9. Try get Decagon's got 0 to 12. But what am I trying to make? So we solved the question and know it's showing 11 times 11 times 11 times 7 times 3. Oh god, please tell me I don't have to. How much is that? Eleven? Oh gosh. Uh oh. Oh, thank you, thank you. Two seven nine five one. Ah. Okay, then I should be able to do this. So, two, 
Okay, zero, one, two, one, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, five, one. Okay, uh... Right, what is that giving us? That is giving us... something five one I'm trying to remember what human is okay so human something name five one for the human. So that's actually... Hang on. Three times... Okay, so twelve... Twelve main five one. Human, moon, moon, human, human, star, double circle. Okay, so do I need to do something with that? Oh, hello. Okay, the alien civilization lines up symbols as a means of multiplication. Therefore, the nuclear symbols must be multiplied together to obtain the answer. But what about the numbers in a column? Humanity's use of 10 as a decimal base is simply because we have 10 fingers. The intelligent beings in this alternate world have 13 fingers and multiple arms. But then, what exactly are the numbers for the other method based on? Okay, I guess we're not doing anything more with that. Hmm. I still have the cards, actually. Okay, yeah, that one, two human, penta, sun. from 
Okay, so this was that one. Uh, shit, I've already forgotten what the second one was. Two humans, wasn't it? There we go. Jeez. Oh, apparently that was the entire bloody puzzle. Okay. Well, now I can take that uh, hydration and care package what? and whatnot. Yes, but... Oh, I needed that. This is a lie. It, it's gotta be. I refuse to believe this is true. And yet it probably is. Sigma! Hey, Fi! Where the hell are you? Are you trapped somewhere? If you can't speak, just, just make a noise! Please, Fi! Please! Answer me, damn it! Uh, hmm. Okay. Diana. Oh, well, bye, Diana. Hey, what's wrong? Are you all right? Yeah. Um. I may have done this in the roundabout right wrong order, but whatever. You okay. A fragment. Yes. It doesn't particularly Thank matter. You. And Fi? This door will never open again, then. Nope. Yeah. Why did Akane leave alone? Well, to be fair, the rest of our team was dead. There's, there's and no all of Q-Team is dead. Over in we only know one thing. Carlos and Junpei are dead. That's it. So, you believe the announcement? Yeah. Well... If what it said earlier is true, then that means Q-Team is dead as well. But unlike C-Team, we can figure out exactly how Q-Team died. Right? They were executed. Likely. Yes, this is the path where they, um... 
where Q team is killed off. Diana, I believe you picked Q team then, right? Yes, but I. I know. You just did as the note suggested. The real betrayer is. Carlos. Mm hmm. Not good. It's almost time for us to get injected again. I wouldn't worry about that. We don't have time to waste. Come with me. Okay. Where are we going? Sigma, what are you doing? The X store will never open again. Now, all we can do here is just wait to die. Wait, you don't mean you're planning to transport? What other choice do we have? Uh, hmm. We have one to wait for Akane. Do you really think she's coming I'm back? Sure, the police or a rescue team will. We can't count on that. But why? This is the tree form timeline then. Uh -huh. Listen to me, Sigma! This is not the time for pointless arguing. We are escaping this horrible history. We're going to where Phi exists. Sigma? I've selected the transfer point. All we have to do is pull this lever. Then. We need to run to the input pods. Wait! I'm going to go even if you aren't. What? I'm starting it. You ready? Ooh, decision time. No. You want to stay or do you want to go? Not an easy decision, this one. Hmm, <laughs> I'm actually forget which one's the right one as well. Uh Oh, thank you. Thank you. Um Tori, I'll leave this one up to you. Should we stay or should we go? Still here, but can only hear bits and pieces. Go! Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Let's hurry. And with that, that's actually the end of the floor, for the moment. Now notice, everything else is greyed out at the moment, except what's on this particular path.
Now that is where we need to go. But uh work uh work is a bit of a fuck you right now. Yeah. Fair enough. Uh so just briefly, I'm gonna show you what happens if you don't take the transporter. I'm leaving between one and two tomorrow. Oh, good! <coughs> oh, God! Ow! Sorry, I. Uh, sorry for the, the lack of warning. Uh, Diana! What are you? This has to be Zero's trap. A trap? Don't you think so? Zero's the one who made us start this thing. Fair. If we transport now, we'll be doing exactly what Zero wants. Yeah, that was a bad idea. What in the... I... I don't know what's going on, but... Pretty sure we should get out of here. Let's go, Diana. I don't think he can go far enough away. Yeah. Seems it is. Yeah. Not surprised? We didn't get injected with the drugs. No. I remembered the announcement from earlier. The decision has now been concluded. Congratulations. Oh. You're stuck. The game's already over. So... It'll be fine. Akane will come back. I wonder. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not so sure I believe that. Considering what he knows about Akane, given what happens in VLR, yeah, that'd be pretty vindictive as well. Hello, Mossy. Hello. Yes, going for a... a Refusing to transport and breaking the machine. Bad idea. How are you, how are you doing, Mossy? It has been a oh. while since I've seen you in here. Oh. Right, so let me see if I... Am I still locked? Okay, yeah, I am still locked into this. Uh, Was that the decision I was just at? Okay, so... Yes, yeah, so a new fragment here. Um, which one do I want? Which one do I want? I think I want this one. Is this the third game? It is indeedy. Uh, let's do this one. Because a whole lot of plots are about to start spilling out. So, the transport apparently was successful. And they're still determined to blind us. Okay, so we Did are... Really work? 
here. Well, we got into the input pods, and we came out of... The export pods? Diana, look at your watch. 1805. Well, we climbed into the pods around 1.30 in the morning on New Year's. So, we went back in time? Yeah, but that's it. Huh. It could be possible that it's 1805 on January 1st, though. Good point. Fair. But it also means it could be two or three days off. Or even three or four years. There's no way to know the exact date or time. Even what we see on this watch could be fake. We have no idea. Very true. We do have no idea. Um, Sigma, can I ask you something? What? You were the one who prepared everything on the input console, right? Yes. yes. Where exactly did you set it to? What do you mean, where? The transfer point for the transporter. Uh, I don't know. What do you mean you what? don't know? It's not my fault. We didn't have time. I, I, I couldn't read any of the text on the display, so I pushed a random button. Oh, for fuck's sake, I'm Sigma. Random. It, it doesn't matter. It's still highly likely we came out in an alternate history. And if that's true... If I could be here... Okay... Bye! 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 Fee, five, four, five. Doesn't fuck. look like she's here. That's a Sigma maneuver right there. It really fucking is. This is. Oh! Ooh! We've come into the reality where D team were executed. Tell me you're safe. Where are you? Answer me! Um, Sigma? Uh, yeah, the dead can't really, really talk. Sure, just saying. Uh, or even if they can. The history yeah. we're in. What was that? Huh? It won't open. Okay, so we're sealed in this anyway, room. Nice. Let's find a way out of here. We'll talk later. Yeah, this is the only one of these games I've seen, and I remember it because of the cutscenes. Yeah, fair. Fair enough. So, straight into another escape sequence. Not bad, considering we're already dead. So we're not getting out that way. Spin. Spin to win. Okay... What do we got on the here? Ah, hair dryer. I wonder actually, can we use this on the Ah, it's a two prong outlet, damn it. Why do fucking Americans have two prongs and three prongs? Like, have one method and stick to it. Seek a way out. Yeah, exactly. Uh, okay, so... Yeah, so... Unplugging the water... Puts it in the other side? Uh, something's at the bottom of the drain, but can't reach it. Okay, can we pour more water in? No, not yet. Okay, uh, what have we got? We have got... Darkness, apparently. A lot of darkness, jeez. Okay, uh, so I guess I'm limited to over here. 
Okay, what have we got? A note. It's not our fault we have our superior power outlets. The rest of you gotta make it hard. Yeah, ours are the safest. We have Earth as standard. It's even a longer prong, so it, you have to be grounded before you can get any electricity. Speaking of electricity, the power supply must be restarted to unlock the door. Thank you, Captain Obvious. If only there was a cat in here, now that would perfectly calm my- Oh, for fuck's sake, his tick's back! You'd think after 45 years he would have done something with it. Ah, uh, if you can't tell, I kind of had a litter tick. A litter tick? Oh my fucking hell. And we've got... A converter. Which looks like a pig's nose from that angle. Okay. There's your... There's your... Three prick converter. Three prick? Three pr Oh, Jesus. Mulligan! You didn't hear me say that. Okay, so... That looks like it's locked with a number pad. That looks like it's locked with... Something. What's this one? A music box? A music box? Runs on water. What kind of music box runs on water? Anyway, I think I could probably put... Yes, there we go. Yes, Sigma, give yourself a fantastic blowout. Yes, I know! I, I was- that's exactly what I was trying to do! Thank you! Violet, white, blue, red... Okay, uh, I'm guessing that was this, because I did see this has colours on it. Violet... White... Blue... Red... Oh, there we go. Actually, the history of the different power sockets in the world is kind of interesting now that I'm looking into it. Wait, really? I mean, I'm not saying ours is the best in the world, it probably isn't. I'm not saying yours is any better or worse, but... 15? Uh, oh no, we're not dealing with fucking coins again. None are especially better, but some are slightly more efficient. Hmm. Uh, and a remote control? Of course I'm gonna push the button, what a silly question. Okay, so nothing's responding. Hmm. None are especially safer from what I can see. Well, to be fair, if I had to choose, if it was one I was going to stand on, it would probably be uh, the American one. You stand on a British one, you're probably breaking your foot. Ah, that's what the coin's for. Okay, I see it. Okay... A reset button. Which doesn't work. Okay, that one's on. This one, I think, is off? Is there any way to get it to move? 
Hmm. Now that one's stuck as well. Okay. Have I missed something? If we can remove the lid, then we can get rid of the dirty water. Hang on. Okay, so it still doesn't respond, okay. Also, they have different voltages, US1s so have 110 volts, so the 220, the Euro sockets, can fry some American electronics. Uh, yeah, Britain's 230, so that might give you an idea. Is that a hose? Uh, not that we'll ever know, because I can't fucking see anything in it. Uh... What is the... Uh huh? I feel like there's something I'm missing. Okay... Okay... Maybe if you put water, more water in the other sink. I don't have anything to get more water with, though. That's the thing. <laughs> you are an old man, Sigma. Right. The only thing I've not looked at is this. Okay, so, hmm. Uh, oh, shit. Right, hang on. So we spun that, and it's not that. So you can't change that right now. This water looks absolutely ghastly. I just want to point that out. Okay, we don't need the hair dryer anymore. Yeah, but we opened the, the locker. What am I missing? Seriously, what am I missing? Okay, so there's nothing left in either of those. Oh my god, really? Oh. Okay, so can I flip this one on now? Oh, interesting, okay. So this side's now dark, but this side's lit up. Okay. Water on the floor is keeping us from searching. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, the dra the dirty water. Uh, that was not what I wanted to do. There we go.
Okay, what have we got? We have got... A bottle cap? Okay, so this is start and it's got a... Just a bit of a problem on it. Okay. What have we got in here? There's a bucket! Wear it on your head to gain defense! Because, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talking with a bucket in your head gives you this really loud echo. I think you've jumped one too many times, Sigma. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, fuck it. Okay, so there's no water coming out of that. There's no water coming out of that. Okay. What's in this one? A water tank? Okay. What is that? Okay, can we use the coin? Okay, the screw's too small, so we need a screwdriver to get into there. Okay, can't... Okay, so we need... Right, okay, so I guess we're coming back to that. Okay, that door is locked. Okay, so we don't have a key for that yet. That's fine. Ooh, hello. Second note. Fully submerge the power supply in water to restart. I'm sorry. What? Okay, so there's no water on that one. Nothing there. And there's nothing on this one. Okay. Basically, the reason we all have different sockets and chiefly the different voltages goes back to the technological races of the early 1900s and each country kind of developing their own stuff and refusing to compromise. I suppose it's the whole argument of AC versus DC. Um... Put it back on again. <laughs> okay, so we have a bucket of water. I remember always swinging full buckets like this when I was young. And getting soaked, probably. Okay. Oh! Yeah, so the water actually works in this shower. Shower head's a little crooked as the screws. Okay, so I guess we're right there. Uh, yes, actually, that's why the different voltages are a thing. 110 was the standard, but then Tesla came in with AC and US, which is like, bro, we can't afford to redo everything. Fuck that. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that definitely sounds like a Tesla move, to be fair. Right, I need to switch this back to the... Uh, uh, I need to switch that back over here, uh, and then pop that in there. There we go, that's what I need. And the other, the only thing, the, the other thing as well, if I remember right, about um, the, the difference between AC and DC, I did, I did physics at advanced higher, so um, I don't want to think or two about it. But basically, from what I remember, if you ever going to, if you're ever going to get electrocuted, 
Make sure it's AC. Because at least AC, your body will... It might grip it uh, for a moment. And then release you from it. It'll give you the... It'll, it'll pull you in, but it'll also pull you out. Uh, whereas DC, it just pulls you in. Uh, I'm going to need to flip the switch again, aren't I? Okay. Uh, so does the key go here? Ah, it does. Okay. Uh, side note, while looking this up, I found a video where Thomas Edison electrocuted an elephant. Yes! To show how dangerous AC was, if I remember right. I didn't know there was a video of it out there. I know, I know it had been documented, but yeah. Okay, so we have the hedge water hose. Ah, wait, I'll come to, oh jeez. Okay, so once the door is shut, it's a sealed room. Let's get out! <laughs> okay... So, we've got something that... We've got a hose. I don't have a screwdriver though, that's the only thing. And I have a start button, but I don't think the start button goes here. Yeah. Um. Have you seen? Hang on. Can I put it on here, baby? Doesn't seem to be the right size. The fault. The holes won't fit. Okay. Okay. So we have some blue screws. So, hmm, it runs on water. But there's no water coming out of that faucet. <laughs> water plant and tropical fish soup. Mm. Right, so I don't have a screwdriver. Uh, curious. Now, why do I still have the remote? Can I close this again? Okay, so I can close it again. But for what purpose? Okay, so let me see. Uh, okay. The holes might reach the shower on the far right. Okay. Okay, so I need to actually connect it to the shower. But I can't connect it to the shower until... Uh... Until I get a screwdriver to rip this shit off. Like, I feel like I'm missing something. Because I don't think I can open this yet. 
Okay, nine buttons. If we search thoroughly, we might find something that will help us. Hmm. Okay, the power supply must be restarted to unlock the door. Fine. Fully submerge the power supply in water to restart. None of that helps me. Okay, so we got the key. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I think we're done with the sink. Am I right? Okay, yeah, because we're done with that. We're done with that. What have I missed? Okay. Okay, so yeah, we need something to take off the shower head. Give me the okay, it just gives us the same message. Right, what am I missing? I feel like I'm being incredibly stupid. Because I need a screwdriver for that, I need a screwdriver for the other bloody thing. Oh, thank you for the timer, Tori. Thank you. that okay so there's nothing I can do there like am I just be dumb like, I feel like I'm missing something I feel like I'm missing something obvious So I've got a start button, but a start button for what? I wonder, can I, can I cheese it with this? No. Maybe I could cheese this with this? I don't know. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm missing something here. Water goes in from the hole at the bottom, yeah. Maybe we could use what we found to transport the water over here. Well, yes, if you fucking let me. <sighs> I 
Okay. There's something there. Okay, okay. I haven't even found anything that I could start. <laughs> I've got not found anything. Hang on, let me. Uh, nothing left in there. Locker's empty. Nothing. Okay, so the lid on the drain is now open. That's fine. Where's the fucking... Okay, uh, yes, the lid is on. Right, uh... Somebody wants to tell me where the damn screwdriver is, or, or what I'm missing, then I'm all ears. I just know I'm going to feel dumb when I do this. Yes, I know we have to take the shower head off. Water isn't coming out of either knob. Yeah, I know. <sighs> I don't know, and it's driving me mad that I don't know. One, two, three. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, okay. Ah, that's already wrong. Um... Not another one of these. Okay, so that looks like it might go together. That, however, does not. Ah, that looks better. That looks better. Okay. Okay, so that is... That, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, uh... That looks... Good? I think, yeah. So that cloud would then go there. Um. Hmm, okay. That would work, yeah. That would... That one would work. That would work. And uh, okay, okay. Is anything here that doesn't look right? I think that's it, actually. Okay, so the uh, I'm back and I got to read more about the history of power sockets. You just know that today's going to be a good stream when you've got people talking about power sockets. <laughs> so the reason for British power sockets is because of World War II, there was obviously a lot of rebuilding to do, but there was a copper shortage. Rather than wiring everything to a fuse board, they put a fuse in every plug in the house and daisy chained all the plugs together to save on copper wiring. Hmm. That probably explains why there's still fuses and plugs nowadays. Hello, fucking screwdriver! Ugh! Oh, that was fucking annoying. Oh, I'm gonna have to switch. Hang on. Right. Get the damn screws out of this. Right. The other end of the music box. We should get both sides bright. Oh, God. We, ha we have to... Okay, fine. The game has dictated that we have to do that first. Because of course it has. Okay, so we open the cover. Ah, round hole! With sticker dick in it! I mean, what? Stick it in the power socket! I know, right? Probably not a good idea. <laughs> okay, whoa! Okay. Uh, ah! 
So what is it? Sea sheet piece. I know what we can use it for. That we can stick in the power socket. Okay. What? What the fuck? Hello, Beligo. How are you doing tonight? Uh. Okay, so can I turn both of these on now? Yes! Yes, I can. Right. Uh, so now I can do this. Okay, so that hose goes up to the music box. I'm good, tired as always. <laughs> Fair. Hmm. I thought something else would happen. Okay. I like the sound it makes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh! Hello! Okay, so there was something in there. Who <laughs> would have thought that my singing would open it? <laughs> Sure, let's go with that. There's a note. Another note. Fucking hell. Fill the room with water. Oh, boy. Uh, what? Ah, uh, well, that broke it. At this rate, the whole room will be full of water. I don't want to drown. We still have some time. I have to stay calm and think. Okay. Well, to be fair, that's draining the water out. The door won't open when we can't stop the water. We can't... Yeah. We can survive this. I'm a survivor. Okay, so we do that. And then we want to make the room fill up faster. Which seems like an incredibly bad idea, but okay. Okay, so the water drained away. The glass shattered. Okay. Okay, so backup power. Restart. Okay. Anything else in here? Doesn't look like it. Whoa! The fuck would you do if you're in that shower? Like, seriously? Like, would you just suffocate? Why is there a door here? Why wouldn't there be a door here? I was right. This door isn't marked on the map. Huh. Interesting. It won't open? Nope. It's locked up tight. It looks like you need to put a code in here. Anything come to mind? <sighs> All I can tell is that it's an eight-digit number. An eight-digit number? An eight-digit number that we have no idea what it is. Like, we legit have no idea what it is. So I'm not even gonna bother trying. 
I wonder if there are any hints around here. Thank you for the hydration as well. Hints. Hints. Oh, don't worry. We will get some hints. <clears throat> so I can't do anything with C team right now. Or with Q team. Everything we can do is with D team. Now, you might have noticed, like we did the transport, uh, we did this one, we did the transport, and we ended up in this reality. But there's still more to do in this one. And I will cover that in a moment. Firstly, partly because of all the hydrates, I'm absolutely bursting, so give me a minute. <laughs>
All righty, I am back, folks, and, uh, yeah, so, we transported out. So what the hell is this reality? What, what is this part of the chain? Well, let's find out. Remember the quirks with the transporter? Well, back in the original reality. <sighs> oh, God, I'm cold. <laughs> so, back in the input pods. What in the world is going on? <sighs> We went into the input pots, and now we came right back out of the same ones. Correct. But not the export pots. Mm-hmm. Did the process fail? Nope. No, wait. Hold on a sec. Let me think about this for a minute, okay? Remember what Zero said. Yeah, I get it now. You understand what happened? Think of Remember it less like said. a transporter, this transporter and more like a fax machine. This one that machine. simply teleports various objects. What is transferred is only the atomic data. The object itself does not get transferred. So it's like putting a piece of paper through a fax machine. The information gets sent to the recipient, but you've still got the piece of paper ago. at the end of the day. The, the first time oh, here you go! Fax, <laughs> she said, The paper came back, Sigma. Maybe it didn't go through successfully. It's the same thing. Just like how the fax doesn't send the actual paper, we too... Our original bodies remain. And only the red data went to the transfer point? Ding, ding, ding. But there's one thing I don't get. What's that? Why is this me? The one that stays. If our data did end up transferring correctly, it wouldn't have been a surprise to see we were in the transfer point world. So why are we still here? Because you're the ink on the paper. <sighs> Sorry. I know how strange this sounds. It's clearly an esoteric conundrum. Esoteric? Even after thinking extensively on it, I'm not sure I'd figure it out. Well, in this but reality, the I do know gate one is thing closed, for sure. so you got plenty of time to think about it. We've run out of cards in our deck. Yep. We have indeed run out of cards on our, in our deck. But there's nothing we can do with that right now. And now all my options are restarted, so that's good. Yeah, so we have a lock here that we can't actually progress through. Um, and I'm fine with that, to be completely honest with you. I am a-okay with that. Uh... So, what do I want to do now? What was this decision? Ah, who killed Junpei? Okay. Oh god, that path goes on for a while. Uh, right, so... I think I'm just gonna pick up another fragment here. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. And who have we not seen in a while? Uh... I've not seen Q-Team in a while, so you know what, let's give this one to Q-Team. 
Uh, and let's do this. Fuck it. Pop off. Okay. Uh, this place is. No, I remember the... this puzzle. Something this like one's a tricky one. A but I don't see any pods here. More importantly, where's Mira? Huh? That's Mira. a point. Where is Where Mira? is she? Well, even if you ask me. Does that mean you don't know? Well, Shit. yes. I hope Zero didn't. I won't forgive him. I won't. Mira. Mira is my angel. Uh huh. Open. Open. Eric, calm down. How can I be calm? Uh, you breathe in and out. Mira might be slowly. stuck all alone somewhere, crying they, her heart Slowly out. at first. <sighs> Eric, you need to stay calm in moments like these. You're just wasting your energy flailing about like that. Please, Eric? I know. Of course I know that. Yeah, but you're an idiot. But there's no way I can just sit still here. Mira, the person most important to me. When I think about how she must be suffering right now. I, I feel the same way. I don't want you or Mira to be hurt at all. It's hard for me to ignore think that about I was it. just doing um I don't Thumbnail have any memories. I don't even know who I am. I can't remember if I have someone important. I know to you and the others, I look suspicious for a person um, just met. But to me, how I am right now, everyone here, is all I have. Why is it? Like, the more I that, look I at this view you in particular. very important to me. Uh, ooh. I want to hate oh, you. Oh, oh, oh. I want to like you. Hold up. Okay, am I am I still connected? Or am I connected again? Perhaps I should say. Because I just noticed that my signal dropped to zero for a moment there, so I apologize for anyone who may have missed a bit of that. Hope it's not too bad. Um. Okay, so back to where we were. Alright, heading out and straight to my appointment. See you in a bit. Oh, no worries, Tori. No worries. Safe, safe journey. Safe journey. Wait, appointment? What appointment? What? 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 Uh-huh. Oh, no, I remember now. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Ignore me. All right, so let's I carry know. on. If I don't, but yeah, why is it every single time really I look at uh, look at him, I keep thinking of fucking dead mouse? Hey, um. Oh I'm yeah, 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 exactly. Before. Yelling at you, I mean. Like you said, we gotta stay calm, right? Eric. Come on, let's find a way out of here. Quick. Will you help me to do that? Yeah, of course. Help me, buddy. You're my only hope. I don't know what that was. All I know is I fucking hate this particular puzzle. Oh, this one drives me bad.
so much for staying calm. There is a keyhole. That's interesting. Three green lines. Okay. Yeah, we don't have anywhere near enough information. Now, I did see something in the cutscene. There it is. Bolt. Strike. Strike. Okay. Anything else on the floor? Well, a lot of things on the floor, but not much interesting. <sighs> baby, baby. Oh, okay. Okay, so I guess there's nothing we can do there. What is this? Okay. Okay, so we can't get to that. How flexible do you think he is? My arm's stuck. Ugh, you're one to talk. Just help me get my arm out. <laughs> right, okay, so what have we got over here? We have got... Thor's hammer by the looks of it, Jesus. Uh, right, okay. Oh, gosh, not sliding door puzzles, please, no. Although, actually, that one wasn't too bad. Okay, and... Eric, you're a prick. Okay, so this one... Wow, okay, they were deceptively easy. We have Thor's hammer. If anyone's ever played medieval, it kind of reminds me of that hammer. Okay, th what the? Why is that upside down? Hmm. Two grown-ups and two babies. Are they parents? Maybe it's just decoration. Okay. And I haven't a clue what's going on here either. Hmm. Okay, no idea what that is yet. So, we've got the hammer and it did say strike. So, can we... Whoa, okay. Okay, that happened. Oh, nothing's happening on that one, okay. And uh, nothing's happening on that one. Oh, okay. I'm just the one in charge of all the hitting. <laughs> Hi, Jean. Why are you talking about babies? Uh, I mean, are you offering? <laughs> uh, no, I'm joking. <laughs> okay, hit it back later if we need to. Okay. Ah, okay. Okay. 
Then this frame sticks out like the other one. Okay. What if we're not supposed to hit somewhere? <laughs> Okay, just keep going. Okay. Uh, oh, that, was, that had the opposite effect of what I wanted it to do. Whoa, what is that? So we go from babies to mirror's thighs. <laughs> okay, so we're not reaching there, but I need to get that rotated, it looks like. Uh, hmm. Now, how am I doing this? Oh, I can hit the same one over and over again. Okay, that makes more sense. Okay, so I got the gear over there as well that I, I need to go get. Nothing we can do with that, that's fine. Okay, does that? Yes! Yes it has! Okay! So, we have a driver tip? It's toothy, okay. How are you doing today, Jean? Uh, ooh, hello. Hello. Uh, well, we know where it goes, but fuck if we can get to it. Uh, hang on. That's fine. Right, so I can now do this puzzle. <laughs> I'm okay, how are you? I'm doing... I'm doing, let's just put it that way. Uh, ooh, okay, this is a bit of a trickier one, maybe. Okay. Oh, actually, that wasn't too bad. Okay, so left lock's done. Doing the right one. Uh, I keep missing your streams, unfortunately, Gene. Um, I would uh, like. I wish. I wish my roller would be more. Um, I guess you could say considerate. Uh, okay. Actually, that wasn't too bad either. Okay. So I was expecting these to be a lot harder, just saying. Okay, and the picture as Yudo? Become me. Okay. Well, I'm trying to put it in. I wonder, can I? 
Yay! Okay, I can't do that yet. I'm just glad you're kind of taking care of yourself. What do you mean, kind of? <laughs> um. Uh, oh, oh, for God's sake, there's more. <sighs> oh, God, this one's actually complicated. Uh. It's not going to work. Uh, reset that. That one. That was not easy. Hmm. Oh, okay. Uh. Okay. What's my starting point on this one? Ooh, ooh, this is a toughie. Actually, this isn't too bad. Never mind. Oh, no, actually, no, this is this still isn't too bad. Uh, okay, get the thing. Okay, so I guess that's what that's for. Activate form of large driver. <laughs> what? Wanted to win powers? Activate! You absolutely were. Don't you lie to me, you little shit. Okay, uh... Right, so what am I trying to get to here? Uh... Oh, okay. So I gotta get okay. So sip okay. So red adds. Okay, so red adds and blue subtracts. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so I can't go negative. That's fine. Okay, so... So... 17, 8... 12... Okay... 
to... Oh, fuck. Okay, so that done that. Okay, uh, and then what? Well, you said you were just R. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Work has been kicking my ass. Um. Right. So. Uh, I've still got one more day of it. Um. Although I get Easter weekend off. Though I am working Monday and Tuesday, I'll get Wednesday off, and then I'm working Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, next Monday. Or following Monday, I should say. God help me. <laughs> uh, yeah, I can do it. The question is, do I want to? Okay. Six. Okay, so there we go. That's actually not. That wasn't too bad. Uh, hopefully, the weekend will let you recharge. Yeah, well, I've got six hours to go between now and then. <laughs> I tried to get today off actually, because they were offering uh, me to. They were offering the opportunity to swap my shift to uh, like to take tomorrow off and then work the hours back on various days next week. So, I'm on six shifts next week, and I work six hours a day. So, I figured, okay, why don't I just work an hour extra on the days that I'm in next week? Not gonna break, no, it's not gonna break me too much. Nope, they wouldn't allow that. They only want, they wanted me to work it on the one day I had off. I'm like, yeah, no, I'm just going to come in tomorrow. Right, okay, where the fuck do I go on this one? 35. Oh, this is a tough one. Anyone? 16. Oh, there we go. Yeah, eight days in a row, working eight days in a row, they can, they, 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 yeah, no. Okay, and we have a, a thing. Okay, I've done that, but for what purpose? Oh, I see what the purpose is. There we go. Okay, so we've done that now. Is that a shotgun? That's legit a shotgun, isn't it? Well, I'm, go I'll I'm gonna come back to that, because I want to check this first. Family. What? Thank you, but why? Well, 
Well, hello. Uh, thank you for the um, thank you for the uh, the prime sub. I'm Hannibal. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, hope hope you enjoy the emotes that that brings with you, the ad-free viewing, and um, welcome to the badness that is the bird cage. How are you doing tonight? I got you, bro. Ah. Much appreciated. I <laughs> uh, hope you hope you're doing well. Okay, so there's nothing we can do with that yet. So, oh, for fuck's sake, not another one of these. Uh, ooh, ooh, this is actually looking to be quite a tricky one. Okay, uh... So... Oh, God, this is a tricky one. Hmm, actually, can I move that here? Uh, okay, so then if I move this down one. I'm good, mate. How are you doing? I'm doing not too bad, thank you for asking. Um, work's still kicking my ass as always, but, uh, I mean, it wouldn't be work if it, <laughs> if it wasn't. Uh, right, so let me... Right, uh, ooh, okay. Okay, uh... Okay, so what if I... What if I do that? Let's put that there for a bit. Well, that's actually that ain't gonna help me. Uh, uh, although that might, because then that can get this out, and then I could move this, get them out the road. Okay, 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 okay. Ah, uh, wow, this one's actually kicking my ass. Okay, uh... Hmm, actually, hang on, could I... I mean, that would work. Although, actually, I think I need to do that so I can move this one all the way down. Uh, and then, right, so I need to... So, gonna need to move something out of the road. Cause this this piece needs to be on the top. Or the bottom. Okay. Let me just do that for a sec. Uh -huh. Uh 
This is not going my way. I'll restart it because that. Ugh. So this one needs to end up very top or very bottom. <sighs> okay. the other one first let me try this one Ugh. actually this one doesn't look as bad Bear with me. I will get this. I hate Slater puzzles. I fucking hate them. Like, with a passion, I hate them. But funnily enough, that works. It doesn't quite do what I want it to, but... Uh... Although, hang on. Hold up, hold up. So if I can put that there, put that there. Uh, oh, hang on. Oh, sorry, I need to... It. Ugh, I'm just putting it back to what it was. Um... Right, okay, uh... Oh, actually, that, that there, and... Okay... Come on! Well, that can't be right. That, like, that physically can't be right. Uh, although, does that at least give me options in terms of moving this elsewhere? Hmm, okay, and, uh... Get it out of the road at this point more than anything else. 
Uh, hang on. Uh, da, 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 da. Wait, no, 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 no. Alright, put that there, put that there, put that there. And then stick that up all the way, that up all the way, that up. Oh, no, that's not gonna work. Shit. So do that down one, put that there, put that up there. That gives me more room there. Then... Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we're nearly there, I think. Oh! Okay, maybe I need... Ooh, okay, hang on. Actually, need to go there. Actually, hang on. No, 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 no. If I put one of these up here, I should then be able to put one of them there just to get rid of it. And then. Then, okay. I will get this! I, I, so help me God, I will get this! Okay, oh, oops, uh, that one down to there. Oh, I am so close. Okay, there we go, I think. I think. No, though, no. Shit! Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. I'm overthinking it. Why can't I just do that? Okay, so that's that one done. This one is throwing me. Hmm. Oops, shit. No, no. There we go. Alright, so that deals with that. Okay, I mean, that's closer. So I think this piece needs to be in the bottom left. 
Well, that doesn't help me. Okay, so that clearly ain't right. <laughs> Okay, uh huh. Uh, hmm. Right, so put that one there. And that there. And that there. Oh, okay. Uh, this is not gonna be as easy as I thought. That didn't help me. Actually, I wonder, can I... Just for a second, can I cheese that? Still will work. Uh, hmm. Yeah, because none of that helps me. Also, seeing that, that is a little better. Not much, but it's it's an improvement. So I need to get this one over to the left. Hmm. Right, okay, now that I've done that, that Hopefully gives me something to work with. Um. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, I feel like I'm so close. No, no, no. Okay, uh, right, hang on. No, 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 I kind of need that on the left. So what if I... Do... Hmm. 
Fucking hell! How the hell do I do this one? I think I've got to move this green one down into this pink one. I think that's the gimmick. But I'm confused. I am confused. In case that wasn't obvious. Okay, 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 um... I wonder. I wonder. Because I physically can't even get past it. Uh, so... Hmm... Hang on, uh, so far... Okay, uh... Ugh, that really didn't work. Um... Just a moment. Uh, mm. Okay. Actually, hang on, hang on, hang on. Move that, move that, put that there. And then move this all the way to down here. Uh, just move that there for a sec. Move that there for a sec. gonna need to be at the top pretty much because this one can never get past the C block which means the C block has to be at the bottom Ok, 
Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so if I can do that. Uh, oh, actually, hang on. Uh, Right idea, roll way around. Uh, <laughs> no, that ain't gonna work. Uh, Maybe this doesn't need to be far left. Maybe this one needs to be far left. This needs to be in the middle, but at the bottom. That would make sense. Not gonna help anything. Alright, hang on. Uh there. Okay, I think this needs to actually be in the middle. They or that or there. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> I nearly just walked right past the solution. Whoops. That's probably not even close to the intended method, but you know what? Fuck you, I have a shotgun. Okay, we have a shotgun. Why? You look like the person who dies first in a zombie movie. <laughs> Okay, then what are we doing with it? Are we breaking that? Uh -huh, okay. Okay, so let me click the button. Uh, whoa, okay. Oh, oh, that was a tricky one. I did say that, that, uh, that I hated that one. Okay, we have a Mira. dead mirror on our hands. Mira. Electronic key? 
<laughs> oh, look at you, you little fucking crybaby. There are marks on her neck. Mira must have been strangled. Help me, you'll be back, Daddy. You're my only help. Stop it, Daddy! You're <laughs> going crystal. You... Shut up! <laughs> wow. bad one he he said to do it he said to do it and that's why i put it in the lake i put chris's body in the lake oh no no i must keep smiling keep smiling keep smiling the words mental breakdown don't begin to do injustice hey eric look ah oh, this is the reality word Junpei was decapitated, I see. No! No! It can't be. Junpei? And what the shit was that? Okay, minor spoiler on that one. Oh, my stomach. Ow. I don't mind telling you this. Um, two bagels is not enough to last you an entire day. I'll have to change that soon enough. No. Carlos just killed Akane. Then he must have killed Junpei too. Okay, yeah. Q team, Mira. D team, Diana. Five, Sigma. So Base we've got our six names to get the fuck out of here. As a result, six X passes will be revealed. June, Jump, Virgin, Blue, Red. Virgin? Okay. That is all. Six. Six people are dead. In blood returns, if six of you die, the rest will gain all of the passwords and will be able to open the next door. Yeah, we can get out. What was that? Did I just hear you say yes? Uh, no. Six people died! Right. And you... Oh, I get it now. So that's it. You teamed up with Carlos, didn't you? What? The reason D Team died is probably because of the vote at 1330. You and Carlos knew that it happened. And then Carlos took care of Junpei and Akane while you killed Mira here. No, no. That brings the number dead to six. Yeah. So that's why. You did all that to get out of the shelter! B but I... Ah! Wait, wait! It... hurts! You killed Mira! Just kick him! You killed her! You killed her! Eric! Eric! Thank you! Jesus! <sighs> Shit. 
Oh, that's what the key, the key was for. Okay. Jeez. The passwords. The X passes are. Hey, what are you doing? Why does he still have the fucking shotgun? He didn't shoot us? Oh. No. Oh. That's a problem. Wait, Herrick. I didn't kill Mira. You didn't? Of, of course I didn't. I could, I could never do some... Then tell me who did it. Tell me the killer's name. But I... 20 seconds. That's all I'm giving you. 20 seconds? Oh, jeez. You geez. better tell me the truth. I... I don't like liars. Now, tell me. Who killed Mira? 19? 18? Okay. Is this actually timed? Oh shit, it is! Me? I killed Mira? <laughs> Why? Yeah, that was the wrong decision. <laughs> Yeah, that was absolutely the wrong decision. <laughs> right, so where was that flow? Uh, who killed Mira? Eric's rage. So what's the correct decision then? Okay, uh, let me ha let me have a think about that one. Let me have a think of that one. Um, I mean, the truth of the matter is, oh, excuse me, the truth of the matter is, we don't know who killed Mira. I'm going to try something here. I could... Then tell me who did it. Tell me the killer's name. But I... 20 seconds. That's all I'm giving you. You better tell me the truth. I... I don't like liars. Now, tell me... Hmm. Who killed Mira? Nineteen? Eighteen? I don't think I can answer this. 
I'm gonna try to not answer this. As controversial as this sounds, Okay. Well, it's a different cutscene. I don't know. No. Oh. Fuck. Oh, excuse me. Well, that's a problem, considering the machine do is, is, is broke. Well, he didn't shoot us, so it is different, hey. I guess. How could any of this even happen? Mira was everything to me. A lowly ice cream clerk and a beautiful goddess of a customer. Dude, she was gonna kill like a rare you. Flower forever out of my In reach. certain reality, she already has. It made me happy just to see her smile from behind the counter. But I took her order, and and we spoke for a bit. Day after day, we talked like that. Oh. I wanted to be with her. If she needed help, I wanted to be there. Stalker much? I started to feel like I'd... Well... I'd do anything for her. Definite stalker. Mira was the one to ask me out the first time. Every date after that... She I asked the initiative. you out? The longer we dated, the more and more I came to like her. I really loved her. Yes, Somehow, she wanted your heart. I felt like she was a lot like my mother. To tell the truth, I don't really remember much about my mother anymore. She died when my brother and I were still pretty small. But, but she was a good cook. Well, thank and like that. And clean. She was always smiling. And above all, her gentleness and warmth are what I remember the most. Fair. Mm. I guess putting it that way, her and Mira aren't very similar at all. <laughs> but still, you don't say I felt something in who Mira is. Something that's a lot like her. Everything just seemed so bright after I met her. I couldn't help but think every day was great. Oh, that might not have been I was a going good to propose. Plan. I scraped together all my money and bought an engagement ring. And then, then, why? Why did this have to happen? Hey, Eric. Let's work together to find the killer. I'm really sad Mira died too. I'll okay. Never forgive the person who did it. That's why. Hmm. This is. What the fuck? Uh, hang on. Why did the flow just end there? Another fucking story lock. Oh my god. Uh, I keep running into bloody story locks. Alright, well, speaking of story locks. Let's see if I can clear this one off, at least. Who killed Junpei?
Well, last time we said that we did. Who call me? Rational. Who is the most threatening person here right now? Whoever it was who killed Junpei. So what I need to do is remove that person. Even if it ends up being me. I love how they plant the idea in your head there. Okay, it could no be him. It could be me. So then, then... Ah, there you are. Damn it. Just who did it? I'm curious, actually. I want to see if the game is smart enough to... to, to realize this. Thought of it. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. That is brilliant. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> well, I've got thumbnail material. I can't believe the game felt that far ahead. Wonder. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try a couple of other things. Ah, it just gives an error for that one. Dang. Eh, dang. Oh well. Uh, anyway, let me just go through the correct option, or what was a correct option. Oops. <laughs> With the doctor. Oh, well. <laughs> well, I mean, if you put your mind to it. That's right. Akane. She has to be the one who killed Junpei. Die! Akane, why did you kill him? I told you, I didn't. I didn't kill him! Well, that's one way to kill a carny. <sighs> oh, you canny shove a carny off the bus. Uh, Carlos? Oh, I knew it. You. No. I didn't kill. Junpei. I'm sorry. You. Akane? <laughs> I... I just killed... You did. Although he's kind of got an interesting point now, because where are we? See, that still leads on to another story. Another fucking story lock. Come on. Uh, looks like I'm doing some new shit though. Uh, right. 
I want to try and find this one if I can. So it's a, so a D team start. Okay, so that's force quit. What is this one? Okay, so that one goes down four and then splits oh. off. If, okay. And then that one goes down twice and splits into three oh. directions. Okay, so it's... Okay, oh. okay, 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 okay. So, yeah, let's go back to D-Team. And I think it's this one we need. What time is it? I've been going a little longer than I ever thought. Outbreak. This ain't Resident Evil. Although, Are these things Zord robots? of the Enders. Yeah. Are they real? I doubt they're model toys. Hey! Hello? You expect them to talk? Well, he's not very friendly. It's probably just out of power. <laughs> Still, why would these things be in this room? Looking around, I'd say they were being made here. Made? Yeah. Zero's probably manufacturing them. It, it does it say is this room is this room, manufacturing yeah. on the map. Mm. Uh, um, Sigma, why did you get quiet all of a sudden? Oh, no reason. Uh, no reason. It's because he spent 45 years manufacturing golems. Damn, it's locked. Guess we're trapped in here. <laughs> Again? Again? What do you mean again? Diana, what time is it? It's 1810. There's no use wasting time in a place like this. Let's just find some way out of here. Okay, let's go. Hmm. Okay, puzzle time. Again. <clears throat> Okay, that, so there's nothing we can do with that. Uh, and we get this one. Each robot here is a little different than others. Okay, a bit of trial and error going on in the designs. Hmm. So the ones made later are better than the early ones? Eh, I don't know. What is this? I vote contractor. Hmm. Okay, what is this? Something written on it. Contact between the red and blue balls will result in an immediate powerful explosion. Ew. Set the timer with the buttons above. Oh, jeez. Okay. Just because what's going on in Zero's head? Well, that's a question. What the heck? A screwdriver head? Just the head? Okay. Hmm. Red and blue balls inside are... Oh, no. Okay, so let's not touch that yet. That's fine. 
Pair of pliers? Oh no, wire cutters, okay. Okay. Uh, oh, what's this? Screwdriver grip, okay. Okay, so we have a screwdriver, okay. Cut char. Okay, uh, that doesn't help me. Dummy color, red, blue, white. Close it now. Surveil near What the fuck? Cut Betty. Hmm. From the far left, four right, one left, two left, four right, three left, boot up. What? And a stun gun, okay. Ah, dang, I was trying to see if there was any prompts. Okay, nothing left on the table. Okay, uh, nothing we can do there. Four of them, oh god. Okay, what have we got? Okay, we're back here. Anything? Oh, hello, I didn't see that first time. Alex Betty Charlie. White, red, blue. So, white is Alex, red is Betty, blue is Charlie? Oh. I wonder... Can I cheese this? Wow, that worked. Failed. Oh, 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 left, oh, right, one left, two left. Okay. From the far left, four right, Four right, one left, two left. Four right, three left. Okay, so I think I had the right idea, just I probably should have started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Okay, so I think I need to do that.
There we go. Jeez. Okay, so they're all activated and they're all doing different things. Okay. Okay, this one started up there. I am out. Okay. I am Betty. No, 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 anger. Put down set timer to zero seconds. What? Okay. My name is Charlie. I'm only saying this one solicit up. <laughs> Are you stupid? I mean, I have my moments. Right, uh... this okay so that's no okay I need the screwdriver but where is it Set it to zero seconds. Betty has activated the timer inside the box just now. Oh jeez. The ignition signal will transmit in five minutes. Oh jeez. It can be disarmed if you choose. You only have to cut the correct wires inside. Don't pick the wrong one. The hints to the right wires should be left by the designer. Alright, so what does that one look like? Cut Betty. Which is the red wire. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we disarmed it. Good, but... Why do I feel like we're still not done? Okay, first part done. Good. So the blueprints and notes were close to disarming this. Okay. Why is it staring at us? <laughs> Please take this. Alex's note. Okay. Cut Betty.
Okay. Hammers and a pendulum. Oh, jeez. Let's uh, not touch that yet, shall we? Okay, removed all the screws, that's good. Oh, thank you for the hydrate, Tori. How's your appointment going? Okay, now that looks more familiar. Whoa, hi! I love lamp. I drink your milkshake. I am Spartacus J What? Time, time, forward, back, hee hee, but nothing to see here go away. What? Alex gave us a note. Just got done on my way to look for a caller for the new edition. Ah, okay. Right, so we're still not done. Why do I feel like this is not an easy decision? Uh, hang on. So Alex's note said cut Betty. Oh. But on this one, it says cut Charlie. Which one was Charlie? The blue one. Okay. Okay, well that's good. Now we only need to take off the screws. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Oh my god, we're still not done. The blueprints and notes were the clues to disarmaments. Okay. Mm 
Whoa! Hey, what the fuck are you doing? Nobody puts baby in a corner, corner. Here's Johnny. I'm the doctor. Who? Ha what the fuck? Where's Dev when you need him? Talking about Doctor Who and shit. Uh, I'm no expert, but that thing is heading towards the ball. Alex gave us a note that says, cut Betty, but I don't seem to cut the real thing. Now there's three of them. Oh, jeez. You have one last wire to cut, you know. The rest are dummies and will explode when cut. Oh, jeez. Cut the tamer wire. The one with the oldest memory has the answer to which one it is. The one with the oldest memory. Oh, jeez, right, so that would be Alex's note. Cut Betty. So, Betty is. the red one? Oh, thank Christ. Whew. Oh, that actually went pretty smoothly, all things considered. <sighs> that seems like it went all right. Let's go. Yeah. Well, I can have my I've care package now. Room long enough. Lurk while I'm in this loud as fuck store. Uh, yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Ah. Where's Gab? I don't see him. Maybe he went off to another ward? Possibly. I'll go and check in the prep room. <laughs> Why there? Well, he could be coming through the air vent. Fair. Sigma, did those robots cause you to remember something? Yes. The robots? The ones we saw when we were in manufacturing. You started acting so strange after we entered that room. <laughs> I've made a few before <sighs> in the past. You made robots? Well, you say in well, the past. It was actually in the future, but really okay. made was the outer appearance and the AI. The frame was built somewhere else. Why did you make them? It's a long story. Let's just say that it was vital to the completion of my plan. No, maybe that's not quite yes, true. Yes, yes, yes. Get on with Could it, have Dr. Just been my Sigma. Cover, to tell the truth. I was simply lonely. I spent lonely. several decades of my life alone. In the middle of a desolate desert. I lived in a facility built deep underground. Much like this shelter is. Sometimes an acquaintance stopped by, but that was it. No calls or even emails. It was a place of complete and utter quiet. <laughs> No rain, no wind, just a buzz. I love how he describes it as a desolate constantly. desert. It's literally the fucking moon. Still, it wasn't as if I was all alone at the start. Someone was there to help me for a short while after I started living at the facility. A woman. She was very lovely, kind and gentle. Her name was, well, let's just call her Dee. Dee and I... We lived together for three years. 
We spent the time researching genetics and studying various subjects like okay. quantum mechanics, cosmology, biochemistry, and artificial intelligence. But the woman passed away. Why? Old age. The city's environment was very particular. Oh, okay. To be brief, it had weak gravity. As a result, an illness developed within her circulatory system. My grief overwhelmed me. Two, three years passed, and and the pain was as fresh what as ever. What possible sickness could a See, lack of gravity, gravity cause? I recreated Dee's appearance as best I could. I made her thought patterns match as close as possible. I spent 25 years completing her. And of course, it was impossible to perfectly replicate everything about D. Still, she ended up pretty close. For a robot. I named her Luna. Luna was very devoted to me. I also found that I truly loved her. Not as a woman, but... More like a daughter. Do you hate me? No, I'd never. I'm just really confused. <laughs> that's kind of the that's kind of the entire game, isn't it? Sigma, how old are you? I'm sixty seven. No. You must be joking. <laughs> hey, Diana, Sigma, come here. No, his mind is 67. His body, not so much. What is it? I've come up with a plan. Oh, that's brave. Would you bring out the map, Diana? What's beyond the decontamination room? The hall for the elevator. So that would mean? If we open this door, we can get out of here? But how would we get it open? It's welded shut. Nothing less than a bomb would manage to dent it. Was well, it a good thing then, we have one? Let's use one. What? Let's just use a bomb, and boom, the door will be blown away. Wait, you don't mean... To be fair, that bomb did... did disengage. If I remember right, we only need to set the timer and press the start button? Correct. Once the timer ends, the red and blue balls are released. When they both touch, that's when it explodes. Yeah. Okay. Get to it, Sigma. <laughs> the two of us? We'll see you back in the lounge. Wait a second. You want me to carry it by myself? Men lift the heavy stuff. Oh, fuck it's you. It's been the way of things since olden times. I'm the old one. But your body's 22, right? Eh, uh, she's got you there. Don't forget to be careful moving it, okay? If those two balls touch early, we're goners. Diana and I won't have a way out anymore. Your concern for me is touching. <laughs> okay. Let's go, Diana. Oh, Fight um, is okay. such a bitch. Real? <laughs> <sighs> the stun gun? Phew. All set to go. Congratulations. Who the hell made you head honcho? Call me Boss Fi. Fuck you. When did you get so high and mighty? Since birth. Yeah, th that that I believe. Some real characters. Please, you two. More importantly, looks like the timer can only go up to three hundred seconds. I mean, that, minutes, yeah, huh? I was busy. That's still five, five minutes. minutes is so yeah. Plenty of time to get enough distance. Now. 
Are you all ready? Yeah. Ready when you are. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. I think this is far enough. Okay. How much time is left? I'd say four minutes, 30 sec... No, 20 fuck! seconds. Fuck, fuck, oh, fuck, 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 no, oh. no. <laughs> Welcome in, ghost. Welcome in. How are you doing tonight? How's Wednesday? The execution. What? You forgot? Diana picked C team during the vote at 1330. Wait, what are you saying? Diana chose to vote for Q team. Isn't that right? I. I. Doing okay. Wednesday's doing okay. I think she's being a bit of a handful right now. Yeah. Kind of gone with Luda. Meanwhile! What kind of nonsense are you trying to pull? Did you really believe that I wouldn't notice? Zero. What you're doing right now is considered a rule infraction. You are not allowed to leave by means other than the X door. That is one of the game rules. We never heard that rule before! As such, I decided I must break the rules as well. Q team is on the other side of the decontamination room at this moment. They lie unconscious from being injected with the anesthetic in their bracelets. Just so you know, the bomb you activated is really quite powerful. Okay. It's true that I've never had a cat before. A door in the decontamination Trust me, room she's going to be a handful. Apart, just as you had planned. At the same time, that means the deaths of the oblivious, slumbering q -tain. So, what will you do? There are three minutes left. You can stop the timer and save q -tain. Or, leave them to die. And make your own escape. Hell of a choice! Hey, wait! Diana! Okay. <coughs> okay. Hydrogen fluoride, eh? What the hell was that? I think it's liquid hydrogen fluoride or hydrofluoric acid. Hydrofluoric acid? It's a powerful acid that can even melt glass or metal. How do you know that? I know because I just do. It doesn't matter. It's definitely some kind of acidic liquid. There's no way we can get inside. This is what a protective the suit. Heck? We can go in if we put this on. But there's only one. Okay. I'll do it. No, Diana. But if someone doesn't go in, Q team will then I'll go. No, I won't let you. Stop it. We're already too late. Even if someone gets the suit on, we won't make it in time. Come on. Let's get out of this room. There's no other way. What are you saying, Sigma? Yes, what are we saying? So... Will we run away and let the bomb explode and call Zero's bluff or that it might actually um, uh, kill him or uh, kill Q-Team or do we stick around and disarm the bomb and play by Zero's rules. 
Go ahead and put your vote in chat. Uh, first one I see, I will do. Run. You want me to run? Okay. He's still in there. Sigma! Sigma! What are you doing? Open this door! I have to do this. What do you mean? You would have tried to hold me back if I said I'd go, right? You... lied? Anyway, there's no time. You both need to get as far away as you can. Stop messing around. You're just gonna die? That's not it. It's just in case. I won't die. I will save everyone in Q-Team. So... Sigma! 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 I mean, I do feel for her. Hell, I feel for them all. Ooh! <laughs> Okay, so Diana got the ever-loving shit blown out of her. And not in a good way. Sigma has lost an eye and two Sigma. arms. Sigma! Sigma, hang on! Ooh, he's actually a shrapnel in her. I never saw that before. My God. We... We need to get him medical attention. No shit, Sherlock. What was your first clue? I'll go check the other room. So, let us get the fuck out of here. Except... Please, no! Damn it. Why? Well, Eric's dead. No big loss there. Gyu's dead. Child. Why such a small child? Hey, are you all right? But Mira is alive. Fi, where are the others? I see, they're all dead. I'll be joining them soon. Zero told Ooh. us. It was you, wasn't it? You set the bomb. That's okay. You deserve something nice in return. And yes, this is that reality. That would what? be Radical Six. What did you just inject me with? Maybe you've heard of it. That virus. If someone infected with the virus was to go outside, then mankind, six billion people, will die. What? 
Did you... Well... Do you like it? My present to you. Fine, wait! What the fuck was that? Oh, okay. No. Uh, uh, who knew this would happen? Well, you did. My body like this. Phi injected with Radical Six. Everything points to a single truth. Yeah. What truth? It seems this history is the one that connects to that future. That future being... Well, I guess DLR. would be the past. Diana, you must not use this lift. What are you saying? We need to get you to a hospital as soon as possible, or... Don't worry about me. No, the two of you need to get out of here. I'm the only one who should stay. There's no point. The rescue team will eventually show up if Diana and I get to the surface. And you know, they'll come down and get you too. Then, kill me. Kill me and burn my remains, now! Fine. I mean, don't get me wrong, it is tempting. There's no other way. That's the only way to keep the virus from spreading. <sighs> come on, hurry! Six billion lives are on the line! I can't. There's no way I can't do that. Oh, sorry for the flashing. I forgot. Oh. Diana, you you know what you're doing, right? Yes, I do. I'm going to save you and Fi. No, you're actually killing him. And, you know, most of a planet, for good measure. So, we made it to the surface. Does this sound familiar? This is Diana. Oh, thank God. You really had me worried there. What happened? Six of us are... dead. What? Counting myself, there are only three left. How... why are... They were killed. I... I guess you could say... I killed them. Mm -hmm. No. No, that's not quite right. Not just them. Not just these six. All of them. All six billion. Soon, I will have killed six billion people. To be fair, uh, Mira was the one that injected them. I suppose this was meant to be. Let's put our hope in the next Sigma. The me who will return here from the future. Yeah. So this is the storyline, this is the ending that goes directly to the VLR timeline.
And I love how they've got the, the Lunar Eclipse there, just as one more homage to it. And with that, we have our third ending. The first D end, the biohazard ending. So now, so far, we've had one ending for all teams, one ending uh, for Q team, one ending for D team. We've still got one for each team left and the final overall ending. But that's where I'm going to leave it for now, because it is late. I am working tomorrow. Not that I want to, but I am. Um, and yeah, we have... Uh, Made some, we've made some progress, you, you, you could say that. We have made a, quite a fair bit of progress. So let me uh, see who we can raid. Uh, so let me just get on to that uh, just now. Um, but no, thank you all so very much for stopping by. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Hannibal, for the um, for the, the the prime sub. I could not think of the word there. Um, uh, thank you, Beligo, for the, the, the bits he threw my way as well. Thank you all of you just for, for being awesome, amazing, awesome people uh, who are also amazing. Uh, and let us see who I have got. Uh, ooh, Catherine. Ah, uh, but we raided them recently. Uh, you know what? You know what? I've not given them a raid in a while, and I'm kind of in a musical mood right now. So you know what? In his own words, anything goes. And I don't mean that song from Indiana Jones. Um, so yeah, let me get you on over to Bone, um, who is just doing a lot of music right now it looks like and uh yeah uh so next time we obviously will pick this back up i want to try and do this a uh, bit more of this shade if i can just to try and clear up some loose ends and probably take a look at, C at c team just in general because we've not really done much with c team in the last uh, couple of days um apart from just this little offshoot um i love how i say that as if you can see my screen <laughs> um <laughs> uh but anyway uh we'll get get we'll get c team over uh to we'll work on c team tomorrow um or the next stream uh but yeah uh remember folks Sometimes fate really does get in the way of things. And no matter how much you change things, they're still going to happen. Or are they? Take care, folks.